Hello everyone and welcome to Everything Star Wars. Thank you again. You all are too kind. You really are. And today, we're going to do questions for creators. And we're going to talk about, well, I'm not going to, but this person right here, Drunk3PO, is going to tell you all about his channel. Who is he? Well, you know how we find out, right? You've been through this before. I ask a bunch of questions, and they answer them. They make a video, and they tell you all about their channel. And all you got to do, which doesn't hurt at all, is hit the subscribe button and notification bell. Check them out. Subscribe to their channels. All the creators. At the end, if you want to check it out, I'll have a link below, which will have all the creators on here including Drunk 3PO. And without any further ado, why waste your time? I asked Drunk 3PO five questions. Let's find out all about his channel. Shall we? What's up, Rob? How are you doing, man? You see I'm rocking, I'm rocking the blue today. Rocking the blue today. Just taking care of business. Listen, thank you for having me on your show today let me put that down and uh just thank you so much for all your hospitality your kind words and uh just wanting to help people out man i really appreciate it i see that you sent me a series of important questions so we're gonna get right into it number one what is your channel name and what is it about my channel name is drunk 3po and it is about star wars a little bit of pop culture and a little bit of everything in between. And why is the name Drunk 3PO? Well, after I watched The Last Jedi, I was coming home confused and just kind of like, I gotta, I gotta know if I'm the only one not seeing this movie correctly. You know, I, got, I gotta know. So I made this Twitter handler called Drunk 3PO because I thought it was the, it, I thought that's how I was feeling at the time. Like take the most uh, proto the, the protocol droid that worries, that wants everything done by the book, that calculates, and uh, see what he would be like drunk. <laughs> so I just put that together, and just started you know going on Twitter and and finding this amazing community of others that felt the same way I felt about what is happening with Star Wars. Just 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 felt the same way I felt, and when my Twitter account started taking you know it started going and going and going it was mentioned that like you start a youtube channel to get some of these thoughts and your creativity out on your channel so i started the youtube channel in october and it's just there's a lot of stuff in here that i'm trying to get out there about my passion and how i feel about star wars and i'm a light-hearted person because i think laughter is a great medicine and so many people and including myself just being angry at you know what is happening to star wars so a lot of my videos kind of hit on the humor side well, i try at least i think i'm funny um who knows you guys be the judge of that and just trying to get people to laugh a little bit while we figure out what in the world is going on with star wars why do i like star wars well it was really important to me because it was a unique bonding moment with my family uh, I believe Return of the Jedi was the first movie that my mom and dad took me and my brothers to go see in the movie theater. And it just was awesome. It's just an awesome bonding thing. You know, I remember Christmas time, we would, me and my brothers would just be like, I'm going to get Boba Fett this year. Well, I'm going to get this and I'm going to get that. And I'm going to get, you know, Luke Skywalker. And then we would have these battles, you know, and we'd make up different planets. And it was just a cool time. It was just a cool time, uh, something that my, my family was proud. You know, my mom and dad didn't mind us watching Star Wars and learning, you know, to protect your friends and learning to to always find the good in people. And, and so they, they just kind of kept getting us Star Wars things. And so it was a unique bonding moment that just carried on, that just carried on to today with them. What do you think about the state of Star Wars? And how would I fix it? Hmm. I'm still, I don't know what to say about that. 
I wasn't happy with The Last Jedi. I kind of wish they had not have continued. I, they call it the Skywalker Saga. I wish they hadn't continued that. Maybe just start brand new. Probably would have been a better idea when they take some of these original characters that we love so much and just totally miss so many golden moments for us, for us fans. Uh, not even putting them all together in the same scene. Not even, you know, just the, the way Luke was portrayed, that just that just never the way he portrayed himself and how they writ him is just it's just not Luke to me. It's not the Luke who I grew up. It's not the Luke that I read in all the EU books or, and everything like that. And so how would I fix it? I don't know how I'd fix it. I would try to do the best I can in episode nine and, and just start that they just need to start fresh with new characters and just let it pull into a direction where they want it pulled. They just should not have probably touched the old, the old characters, in my opinion, in my opinion. Uh, me personally, I really would love to see Luke back and be Luke, the Luke I remember from Return of the Jedi, the one that finds the good in everyone, the one that, that believes everyone could be saved. You know, that Luke, the one that never gave up on his friends, the one that never quit, the one that self-sacrificed for, for so many. That's the Luke that, that I wanted to see and, and not the way that he just kind of puffed away at the end. And uh, that would that that to me would be huge for me. I know other people have other ideas, but to me, that that would be the big one. That would be the big one for me. Um, what is my channel's future plans in 2019? Uh, just keep doing what I'm doing. I love uh, the fact that I get to create and share with many people like yourself and, and other friends that I've made in this amazing community and just bounce ideas off each other and, and talk Star Wars theories and fan theories and upcoming things that they're going to be doing and talk old school stuff, you know, because it's just it's just fun for me. It's fun for me, and I, and I want Star Wars to say fun for me like that because I, I enjoy the subject matter. Um, Star Wars helped me as a kid to read. You know, I, I didn't like reading, but the Star Wars books I love to read. Um, kind of like what we saw with Harry Potter. Harry Potter triggered a lot of young people who didn't like to read to start reading again. Uh, Star Wars was like that for me. So I, I just would love to get back into that, that type of thing with my new friends and my new community. So thank you so much for having me. I appreciate you, my friend. I appreciate all that you do for this community, and um, I really appreciate it. So this is Drunk3PO signing off. So that was my boy, Drunk3PO. Love his channel. Great guy. I hope you check him out, and you also think that he's great too, just like I do. I think all these creators are awesome people. I've subscribed to each and every one of them and I hit that notification bell and I always try to stop by their channels to let them know I'm checking out your videos. Always try. With that being said, don't forget to hit the like button, hit that notification bell, comment down below and if you are a creator and you want to be a part of this, it's very simple. All you have to do is Hit this email right here. That's right. Hit that email. ESW1977 at yahoo.com. ESW1977 at yahoo.com. Let me know your creator. I'll check out your channel. I'll send you the questions and I'll promote your channel. And that's all I have to do. It's just that simple. Again, comment down below. Hit the notification bell. Hit that subscribe button. Come be a part of everything Star Wars family. I'm here. I'm Rob. And you're there. And I want you to be here next time. I'll see you later. Let me know what you think. And I'll talk to you soon, I hope. Take care. Be well and be safe.